This is called South California. There's a lot of shooting coming across, uh, almost as though it's right across the border. But these things are just popping into existence and could easily be seen as venting. And they could be steam too. Like what the heck is that dark? orangish colored thing in there. It's stalled there. The twenty thirty nine. And there's a beam coming out of here. This is where those that submarine launch was. <coughs> so this whole area is riddled with military bases. In fact, this is where the submarine came in, I think. Somewhere off that point. Maybe right around here. And good heavens, we may be looking for Chinese submarines now. <laughs> that may be what this whole thing is for. Doing the tomography to look underwater for submarines. Because the ch Chinese embarrassed us out of here and out of the Gulf of Mexico. And both times they shot a ballistic, intercontinental ballistic missile back at China which I thought was a very interesting chess move. It could hardly be called an act of war, but it could hardly be seen as anything but the threat of a war and proof that we don't have the perfect technological information gathering system. Or if we do, it wasn't cooperating with the decision makers or they wouldn't have been shaken so much. It took them a day to come up with a reasonable answer. Much more subtle energy. That thing in Nevada is striking, strikingly different. Very powerful, or we had a very good view of it, one of the two. Or maybe the air was drier, 